in this atmosphere, I guess uh, your your first time ever. What, what's the feeling like playing in, in this venue at Scott Stadium? You know, it, it's it's going to be incredible. Uh, you know, I, I don't think any of us really expected something like this to happen and be able to come and play in such an incredible place is going to be it's going to be awesome. Just looking at the field right now, it's it's looking incredible. So I think we're all really really excited. What kind of attendance do you think you can get? Are you kind of wondering how many fans will come out for this? You know, it's crossed my mind. I'm not going to put a number on it. <laughs> hopefully, we get a bunch of people out. It'd be awesome to you know turn a big crowd and. You know, hopefully a bunch of people will be out here for the football game too. I guess that's kind of what the plan is, get a big crowd going. So hopefully we get a nice attendance. And it's an important game for you guys, I guess, given what happened last week in Baltimore. How, are you guys pretty optimistic you can bounce back from that, that game at Johns Hopkins? You know, we're, we're really looking forward to, you know, the challenge of trying to come back from a loss like that. And if anything, it's just motivation to, to you know, for us to reach our goals, it's going to be a lot harder than, you know, not more than we expected, but just that there's other teams that are gunning for us and that we have a target on our backs and we have to take that and use it as, you know, energy to get us, you know, forward. And Coming into college, did you, um, you had a pretty nice impact in uh, production. Did you expect to be able to make the contributions that you have so quickly? I mean, I had no idea anything like that happened. I was just hoping to come in and help in whatever way I could. And for my role to turn out to be kind of, you know, be able to help on the field is, is something that you know I, I never expected and I'm just happy to be out there and helping. What are your sort of goals for the rest of the year now like personally and for the team? Uh, I mean for the team it's just just to win and win it all win and win in May is what what really is what it comes down to it and my, I guess my only personal goal is to be to help the team in whatever way I can and like whatever facet of the game that may be. So one of the hardest shots on the team, I've heard. Um, where, where do you get that from? Is that just something that's always been a part of your repertoire? I guess so. It just, I don't know. When I'm, I'm kind of long, and being long allows me to pull it back a little bit further than some other guys, and I guess that's, that's what helps. I guess it's the technique of it rather than the strength of it. I don't, I don't know. Have you ever had the shot like clocked or anything? Like, do you know how fast no, it is? No, I, I've never really gone out and done that. I think it'd be fun to go try that out, but it's, it's not. I'm not trying to see how fast I shoot it. I'm sure people have told you it's hurt before when it's hit them, though, right? I, I feel bad sometimes. I <laughs> always get some nice black and blue marks, but, you know, what are you going to do? It's the cross. Hey, thank you for joining us. Yeah, no problem. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you.